and welcome this cyber security news was published on 3rd october 2018 by readynet.com and it basically says that a subsidiary of google has developed an android application named as intra and this android application basically encrypts your dns traffic or domain name system traffic so basically this application works or use dns over https protocol or doah now this application intra was introduced by the google subsidiary known as jigsa and they uh, released this application on 2nd october and here this application is available on google play store and once you see the details of this application this application basically encrypts you or protects you from dns manipulation by any uh, man in the middle it might be an hacker or it might be an isp so this application was released on 2nd october now here they say that this application can protect you from the censorship uh, by your isp or maybe by the government agencies which they have implemented through isp and from the state uh, level surveillance and from other surveillance for marketing purposes and this doh or dns or https is still under approval by ietf or internet engineering task force which is an organization responsible for approving such standards so this application uh, or dns over http is supported by firefox and android 9.0 and its source code is also available on github now here the uh, uh, is the entire details of uh, the dns over https and basically they says that the http was basically uh, created for web traffic once the internet was developed and http was inherently Uh, does not con- uh, do not uh, did not contain any uh, security because it was basically uh, created for the availability purposes but afterward uh, they realized that security is also important so they uh, created a new protocol https which uh, basically encrypts all the web traffic so uh, previously the traffic was not encrypted and later on they introduced https to encrypt the http traffic and now they say that before using the https you basically uh, request the ip address of the website uh, using dns protocol so that your browser can connect to the website and browser do not understand uh, the website name because website names are uh, for the user comprehension and all the uh, computers or the network devices understand only the ip addresses so this dns protocol uh, uh, is used to translate the website name to an ip address so that your browser can connect to the website now this dns protocol was inherently Uh, uh insecure because it it do not uh, it did not use any encryption so any one on the way was able to see your re- request your ip address or the website you were uh, connecting uh, to so uh, this leads to two types of uh, uh, security exploit one was checking that any marketing organization Uh, or maybe the state sponsored surveillance agencies could see your trend of connecting to websites and build a profile again against you or maybe the marketing 
organization uh, could build a profile against uh, you for marketing purposes and second one was man in the middle attack or spoofing attack where the queried ip address of a website could be modified by a hacker and instead of connecting to the legitimate website it could lead you to connect to a website set up by the hacker for phishing purposes so for example this is the hacker or the man in the middle so instead of getting the legitimate ip address it will give you a fake ip address where he has set up a malicious website for hacking purposes maybe for uh, a website mimicking mimicking the bank of america uh and you put in all your credential in this phishing website and hackers will get all this data or your credentials so now they are introducing a new protocol known as dns or https or doh now this protocol was uh, is uh, using https uh, to encrypt entire dns traffic so first Uh, your browser get the ip address using dns and later on it connects to the website or and request data using https which was secure but dns was not secure now they are also securing uh, the dns protocol by using https over it so it is dns over https these are the entire details of this protocol now this is uh, the website of ietf and here uh, this proto uh, protocol dns over https is still under uh, approval and they have set up a working group for this protocol and this is the android development blog and here they are mentioning that uh, their support for this dns over https protocol and this is the source code of the application which was developed by the subsidiary of google uh, the android application uh, which is using dns over https in the back end and here is the website of this uh, uh, subsidiary this was all from my side uh, I have similar videos on my channel and if you like my effort please uh, stay connected to my website and do comment for improvement thank you